The sanctuary was left desecrated just a few hours before Sunday morning services. The suspect or suspects broke into the building undetected by taking out the security system and stealing thousands of dollars worth of equipment and nearly gutting the food pantry, leaving church leaders in limbo. These doors are never open until church service. Olivia Williamson was first to arrive Sunday morning at Windsor Park Church in South Shore. I noticed somebody had beat this doorknob off, and I'm like, uh, that doesn't look good. And once further inside... Somebody had taken communion. She knew. This is the door they came in. They cut the sensor wire. Something had gone wrong. And they knocked out the lights over here at the very back of the church. So that's how they were able to get through and not be seen. The security system was quickly disabled during the morning burglary that church leaders say likely took over an hour to complete. So they came in and they strategically went through, disconnected the bells. But the hardest hit was the church's food pantry that each month for the past 30 years helps to feed more than a thousand of the neighborhood's most vulnerable, including migrants. They got in the freezers. Now they're left scrambling to replenish what was taken. Just so much discouragement because we work so hard to keep things going. We've got a lot to do from, from now till Sunday. So we're hoping and praying that the public will hear us. The church is now raising funds to replace the stolen items, including the much needed food. So far, police say no one has been arrested. Watch breaking news on YouTube. Subscribe to ABC7 Chicago Eyewitness News.